What's up, YouTube? It's Star Wolf. Make sure you subscribe to my videos. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit that notification bell so you can get my videos when they drop. Okay, I, I really, look, I really didn't want to make no more videos, really, in regards to Big U and Whack, you know. And, and when I do, it's always like some fresh information because I'm not just trying to make videos for the views and just put anything out there like I told y'all before in the past. But as we all know, um, new information then surface, so I'm going to speak on it. Now, my response to what Big U said today in his Instagram Live, okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to address a few issues. I'm going to get right on it. First of all, I want to say this. Activism is the new hustle in L.A. And I'm going to say it again. Activism has become has become the new hustle in L.A. Everybody is hopping off into being an activist, fake activist, because it's money involved. It's other perks involved. Don't get me wrong. There's some, there's some activists that's been on the forefront, that's been on the front lines since day one. There's some gang interventionists that's been on the front line since day one that's really doing good work. I'm not speaking on them. I'm speaking on the ones that's in it for self, that's in it to get whatever they can up out of it. The ones that's not helping the youth. Okay? And don't get it twisted. Big, you're not the only one in partnership with the grid program. It's many, it's, it's, it's many other, it's many others in LA that's part of the grid program too. Cause see the grid program is not limited to the 77th division. The grid program is all over in all the precincts. Wilshire, Rampart, Newton, Southeast, Southwest, all of them. So believe me, it's somebody or a couple of somebodies in every division on the streets coming from the streets that's part in partnership with the grid program that's assisting the police. Now, my response to what Big U said in his video when he was talking about putting things into the universe. OK, that's true. Whatever you put into the universe comes back to you every day, every single uh, moment of everybody's life that's living. Every second we create and we put something off into the universe, whether it's negative or positive. Believe that. That's what energy is. What about the times when he was throwing up neighborhood, throwing up all the gang signs? Yes. Yes, that's evil. You putting that into the universe because negative energy is attached to anything that has to do with gangs. But here it is. You're a gang interventionist. You're a gang activist. But on the flip side, you're throwing up gang signs and you're talking about neighborhood crip. You're talking about rolling 60s. That's attached to negative energy. Something that you're putting into the universe. So you can't straddle the fence when you want it, when you want it to uh, 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 benefit you and talk about people putting things into the universe because you're saying that people is making fake videos and putting fake things out. And if somebody recorded you and it's your voice and you saying that, that's just what it is. You got caught slipping. That's all that is. You got caught slipping, big you. Don't talk about energy in the universe until you really, really abide by it. And then you speak about Ramadan. You don't want to do nothing because you observe Ramadan. OK, that's respectable. I know many people who practice Islam. Many people. But check this out. Just because you practice Islam don't make you holier than nobody else. Just because you practice Islam and, and 
this is the month of Ramadan doesn't mean that you can't still do evil and wicked and foul things because Ramadan is every year. And we've been watching you and we've been observing other people throughout the years and throughout everybody's life do wicked things that still participate in Ramadan. I'm, I know many people who practice Islam and they still foul. That means nothing to me. I don't care what religion somebody is in. That don't mean that they automatically clean. So don't use that as no excuse and don't use putting things into the universe as no excuse because people been on your helmet for the last uh, week now. Don't do that. And then you speaking about uh, smear campaigns and Cointel Pro. You didn't start mentioning that until I mentioned it. This is something I speak on all the time. Now you're talking about a smear campaign because you feel like people is smearing your name, tarnishing your name. You're talking about Cointel Pro, but see, you don't never speak about these things. Never. You never spoke about these things when you got on live. You never spoke about these things in your videos. You never not once hit the streets and spoke and talked to the youth about Cointel Pro and smear campaigns because the youth are the ones who really need to know about this smear campaigns and Cointel Pro and how the tactics is being utilized. But you can't speak on that for the simple reason that you're in partnership with the grid program. And my thing is this right here. When are you going to address that? You keep addressing everything. You keep dancing around it. You're doing the Mexican hat dance that they do. When they breaking the pinatas, when they having quinceañeras, you dancing all around, all around the grid questions. You dancing around that. You keep speaking on Nipsey talking about, man, me and Nipsey was cool. That's my little bro and all that. Okay, we done heard that for the last three years. This grid program thing that came out, address that since you address everything else. And Ramadan going to be over uh, May 1st. That's Sunday. So address it then since Ramadan was the excuse. Ramadan going to be over the first. So let that be the reason. Anyway. Anyway, like I said, that you ain't the only one in the grid program. It's others and they looking like, oh, we. I'm glad don't nobody know I'm part of this. Because straight up is foul. It's super foul. That's my response to what Big U said in his video. And yeah, anything you do put into the universe is energy. And it comes back to you. And if you do speak on somebody in an ill manner and accuse them of something that they not. If you accuse somebody of something that they have not done. Yeah, that does come back on you. But the thing is, has anybody accused you of something that you haven't done? That's the question. If they have, then prove it. Don't dance around it. Explain what that grid program is. If you think somebody accusing you. Explain why your voice on them uh, recordings, if that ain't you. Explain these things. Not saying you obligated because you're not, but you did make a live and spoke up. So it must it, 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 it must struck a nerve somewhere and it's still Ramadan, even though you was using that as an excuse. Put that out there. And quit dancing around, quit doing the Mexican hat dance. Anyway, I'm Star Wolf. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that like button and notification bell so you can get my videos when they drop. And make sure you share my videos so everybody can see. It's a reason why you should share these videos, not for the views and all that. So everybody can actually view the video and see what's going on. This ain't no video that's uh being made by everybody. Everybody doing the same video regurgitated regurgitated uh regurgitated information everybody's saying the same exact thing i ain't saying the same exact thing peace